हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम टू द नेक्स्ट ट्यूटोरियल ऑफ पेंटाउ डेटा इंटीग्रेशन इन दिस ट्यूटोरियल वी विल बी गोइंग टू एक्सप्लेन स्ट्रीम लुकअप इन पेंटाहो सो इफ यू कैन सी आई हैव जस्ट क्रिएटेड अ जॉब इन दिस जॉब आई एम टेकिंग फाइल वन एंड फाइल टू दिस इज नथिंग बट द डेमो फाइल विच आई हैव क्रिएटेड सो दिस इज नॉट अ फिजिकल फाइल आई हैव यूज जनरेट रो स्टेप इन पेंटाहो सो यू कैन सी आई हैव एडेड टू two fields medit and bentuser both are string type and the value i have given is 100 and bw and i have set limit of 100 so whenever you preview the data you will your data will be looking like this okay now what i am going to do is i am just going to use stream lookup step and table b let me show you the table b content okay in table b you can see three fields are present so what what target i want to achieve is i want to extract this particular field using the stream lookup from this input file okay so let me show you the data how it looks like again here we have set limit as 10 so you can see under the preview tab see how the data is coming from the table b so i want to extract this particular field if, uh, from this file okay so let's go so this is the main step where we are performing this operation so what i have done i have taken field a step field a attributes in this particular field and field b that is nothing but the file b that is nothing but the lookup file from where i need to extract this particular field so i have defined it here and the type is string So there are options like preserve memory, cost CPU, and all these options are there. You can uh, you can try. Uh, one important thing. So look up the step I have selected is table B. You can give any one. Okay. So here we are having two input step. So that is why we can see uh, two look up step uh, two um, two drop downs two two values in the in this drop down. You can add any number of uh, Like uh, any number of input data to this stream lookup. Okay, that's okay. Then I have added dummy transformation. This shows the uh, uh, well output value. So let's go and preview this. So you can see in the output step. If I go back, so what all we have achieved using stream lookup. So stream lookup. is basically help us to get the data to get the lookup perform on the files okay so if our data source data is present in different files not in database so we can use stream lookup just to get the data or if we have already extracted data from table then we can again use stream lookup from the uh, from the steps okay mm -hmm. so see in this file i have taken these many values from b file we are taking this values in the stream lookup what we are doing we are we are doing lookup based on these two values and we are getting this value so if you see in the output you will get this values okay fine so that's it for this tutorial so we have gone through the stream lookup step so this is the stream lookup step basics i will go in advance uh, once we move forward thank you thanks for watching